day 39. Whoo! I'm back on the trail <laughs> with my new friends. <laughs> I had three and a half days off in Wrightwood, and now I am hiking with Hummingbird, Milkman, and Jack. <laughs> and we are going to attempt Baden Powell. And uh, our packs are super heavy. We're feeling lazy from all the time off, <laughs> but super excited to be back out here. Yeah, well, I did it with the quarter. Who was going to throw his mom and then realized that it wasn't the silver? Okay. Officially back on the PCT. Back on trail. Back on trail. Yeah, and <laughs> yeah. And we're hitting snow. So Oi. Looks like we gotta go up that way. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So we haven't gone very far and my knees hurt, <laughs> but I think that's from the weight of my pack. It's pretty heavy again and my hip hurts, but I think that is from having three and a half days off. I noticed that the longer I was sitting and laying around in town, the more my hips started to hurt. So I think <clears throat> sitting and laying around is just so not good for it. <laughs> so I think it'll just take a couple days for it to loosen back up and then I think it'll be fine. Yeah, right now it kind of hurts. And yeah, we are going from Brightwood to Acton and up we're going to try and do Baden Powell. And this section follows Highway 2 for quite a bit. So lots of people have been just taking the highway instead of the trail. Um, we want to try taking the trail. So we'll do as much of it as we can. If it gets too sketchy, we'll drop back down to the highway. But uh, yeah, I'm excited to be out here with Hummingbird and Milkman. And uh, if I have a chance later, I'll catch up to date on what's happening with the old crew and why I'm not with them. Keep coming across snowy patches. Yeah. Yeah, I think this one will be okay. <laughs> Log provides the guardrail.
that's Baden Powell. We're uh, gonna try and climb that tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> it looks intimidating, but I keep telling myself it's probably not going to be that much different than hiking any of the mountains at home in the winter, other than I just don't know this one. <laughs> I've never done it before, so I don't know it, but I feel like it's not going to be that much harder or different. Check this out. How cool is this? Wow. <laughs> Very cool. down to that parking lot. Quite a few tents there already. And our trail tomorrow switchbacks up this. <laughs> and then the summit's like up there somewhere. Yeah, that's totally doable. That's not straight up at all. Really glad I'm gonna be with Phil and Laura for this. Cause uh yeah, they've got mountain experience as well, so I feel pretty confident that we'll make smart choices together. <laughs> it's just after 7 p.m. and it is warm out tonight. <coughs> Which is surprising given how close we are to the mountain. Um, so hopefully it stays that way throughout the night. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go to bed now because we are gonna be on the move for 5.30, so 4.15 is gonna come early. And yeah, we're just camped on the side of the highway. <laughs> it's actually pretty cool. Some of the things we've done on this trip have been pretty cool. So, this is up there with one of those things. But anyway, I just wanted to say goodnight and... Morning's gonna come early, so I'm gonna go to bed soon. Alright, good night from day 39.